Hello everyone. Welcome back to Rims English. Today we will learn about informal dresses. In my previous video, I talked about formal dress for males and females. If you haven't watched the video, you can watch that one. So your idea about formal and informal dresses will be much more clear. You must be wondering but why I am putting so much importance on dress. Only because dress reflects your personality. If you do not know in which situation, what type of dress you should put on, it will be really an embarrassing situation for you. For example, in your official dinner party, if you put on sandals, trousers or t-shirt, what would you feel like? You would feel embarrassed. And other people will consider you someone who doesn't have any dress sense. In the same way, in your friend's party or friends get together, if you put on blazer, suit or tie, you would feel yourself isolated and your friends would be looking at you with strange eyes. So it's really important to know the difference between formal and informal dress. Today, we'll talk about informal dress. Informal means when you are having a relaxed, friendly or unofficial style or manner. The dress that you use for friends get together or family program or any short trip with your friends or family, this is called informal dress. At first start with male. T-shirt. T-shirt is really different from the normal shirt because in t-shirt there is no collar given and t-shirt can be both half sleeves or full sleeves. T-shirts are mainly put on with the jeans or trousers. Now jeans. There's nothing more to say. This is totally informal. It is used with the t-shirts or sometimes fashionable shirts. Singlet. This is inner which is put on inside the shirt or t-shirt. Shirt. This is not the formal shirt. This is informal shirt where you will not get any collar. And this kind of shirt can be both half sleeves or full sleeves. Hawaiian shirt. This idea actually came from Hawaii, who are the inhabitants of islands of US. But this is used worldwide now. People use this kind of shirt for comfortness. When you go to any family picnic or a friend's picnic or any short trip, you can use this kind of shirt. Shorts. These are basically used for playing or when you are jogging. Men mainly use this kind of shorts with singlet or t-shirts. Trousers. This is used for exercise and this is mainly used with the tracksuit. Pajamas. Pajamas are actually used for indoors. You can use it at your home. Jacket. This is informal, which is used during the winter season. Sweater. Remember one thing, sweater is used by both males and females. This kind of sweater is actually for the males. It can be high neck collar or low neck collar but it would be full sleeves. It can be knitted with wool. Cap. This is obviously informal. Hat can be formal, but cap is not used in any formal case. Flip-flops. These are the light sandals, which are made of rubber or plastic, and these are used for indoors. These are basically used for toilets. Slippers. These are slip-on shoes which are used for indoors. Now, let's know the informal dress for females. T-shirt. See, here you see the difference between the t-shirt of male and female. Male's t-shirts are actually plain, but female's t-shirt can be of different kinds of designs. Jeans. It is also used by the females. Palazzo. Palazzos are used for the females only. 
long skirt. Long skirts are basically used with t-shirts or the short tops. Short skirt. Short skirts are basically used with the t-shirts. Short top. This is used to cover the top part of your body. Girls use these with jeans or long skirt or short skirt. Long top. These are used with pants or jeans. Frock. Frock can be both long and short. Cardigan. Cardigan is only for the girls, which is used for winter season. And in the cardigan, there may be pockets also. Long coat. This is also used for winter season. Males also use long coat, but the pattern is quite different. Sleepers. You see the sleepers for males and females are a little bit different. The designs are different. This is also used for indoors. So everyone, I hope you are now clear about the informal dresses about males and females. That's all for today. See you in the next video, everyone. Bye. Thank you for watching. Please hit the like button, share the video, and don't forget to subscribe my channel and hit the bell icon.